Let's focus on EPS. EPS, or Enterprise Project Structure, is a hierarchical arrangement of all the projects in an organization. EPS is like organizational chart, or in Primavera we call it OBS. The difference is, in EPS, instead of people, different groups of projects are utilized. Suppose our company is Hunamun. We are active in two fields. One is construction, another one is industrial. Hunamun projects in construction field is dam construction and residential complex. In industrial, it is mining. Let's implement EPS and EPS nodes of this chart in Primavera. In Primavera, for creating EPS, go to Enterprise. From drop-down menu, click on Enterprise Project Structure. In this window, you can see all predefined EPSs. Click on Add. You see EPS ID. If your organization has a code or an ID, you can write here. EPS name is the name of the organization. My organization name is Khunamun. The ID is EL. I have a subset for Khunamun. It is construction and industrial. I want to create construction now. Use these direction buttons to place it in a right place. You see how easily we create EPS. Now let's link OBS to this EPS. From Responsible Manager, I set the responsible whom I created on OBS previously. Here I can see the OBSs which I've created before. So I click on Display, Filter by, all OBSs. Now I click on Project Manager for linking the OBS to EPS. I double click. Now it is linked. If I go to OBS and select Project Manager from Responsibility tab, I can see Construction EPS. Now, practice time. We have prepared Khunamun and construction as EPS in Primavera. Let's pause the video and define industrial as EPS and link it to project manager in OBS. This is how your EPS looks like.